What's up, bro? What's up, bro? What, what are you what doing? Are you up to? What are you doing right now? I am literally working right now. What are you doing? Same, same. I, I uh, have not left this office in like <laughs> six months. How about you? Dude, the grind never <laughs> stops, bro. We have to get these videos out like every month or else Dude. we fall off. It's just the way it is. That happened long ago, let's be honest. Bro, I have the weirdest question. Shoot. Do you believe in ghosts? <laughs> Like goblins, ghouls, like things of that nature. What? Do I believe in ghosts? Like, like the paranormal. Like, you know what the fuck a ghost is? Yeah. Uh, I mean, there's some videos on Reddit that are kind of convincing, I guess. But dude, there's so much fake stuff out there. I cannot. Oh I cannot say that I legitimately believe in ghosts. No. <laughs> Why? Okay. That's fair. That's okay. This is weird. Weird request, but yeah. Basically, there is this place in New York, not too far away from my house. That is supposed to be not only one of the most haunted places in the state, uh -huh. but supposedly in the whole country. And I've always wanted to go. I want to go see what's up. I thought it might be interesting. We go see what's up, visit this haunted hotel, and just go in with an open mind and see if maybe we can come out believers. Because I want to believe. I don't know about you, but I want to believe. Dude. All right, all right. This does sound pretty fun. Hold on, let me, I, I'll check flights and I'll let you know. But I'm in. Let's go. Let's fucking You're do it. All right, let's fucking do it. Let's do it, bro. The year is 1845, and a new hotel called Riches graces the small town of Napanock, New York. Being the go-to destination for those looking to get out of the big city, and even for those wanting to utilize the location's more nightly accommodations, the hotel is a big success. Beautiful, commodious, one of the area's best, it boasts, and over the course of nearly 50 years, always keeps one thing consistent a continuous, welcoming, and lively atmosphere that seemed to be here to stay. On the night of March 18th, 1895, a home catches fire. It spreads rapidly, leaving no nearby structure untouched. During the fire, thankfully nobody died. But the entirety of Rich's hotel, however, did. Almost immediately, work began to rebuild this hotel, and by the year 1906, a man named James Shanley would purchase the building, renaming it to the titular destination we know today. By 1910, James would meet his lifelong partner named Beatrice Rowley. The two had grand visions of a large family, a successful business, and reverence from the town's locals. What they didn't know, however, was that the two meeting would unfortunately be the last good thing that would ever happen to them. In the years following, three of their children, named Kathleen, James, and William, would all die at the Shanley Hotel before the age of one. Beatrice's sister, Esther, would die of influenza just a few years later. A boy named Walter would fall behind a moving vehicle, leaving him with lifelong injuries. And worst of all, a little girl named Rosie would fall into a well just across the street from the Shanley, only to be found after her death. To this day, the Shanley Hotel is known to have over 30 spirits on the premises at any given time. And no matter how many people are brought to this multi-thousand square foot behemoth, it's been said that the spirits will always outnumber you. Stairways, corridors, eerily silent bedrooms, and an unfinished attic await, and they sure talk a big game about it being haunted. And so, that's where Nick, Justin, and I come in. 
because we're going to bring you with us to answer the age-old question. Does the paranormal really exist? Excuse me, guys. Y'all are uh, actually in the middle of my shot, so. Oh, really? Well, you're loitering. Do you have a camera? No, I'm not. I don't see it. Dude, I'm the one with the camcorder right now. Like, do you see me? Wait, yeah, Nick, why don't you have a camera? Yeah, why don't because you have a camera? Of, because are we hired hey, a you cameraman. Know this guy? Well, you want to know what? You know this guy? I trust Justin yeah, enough What's to get your the name? shot. What is your name? <laughs> let me let me give you my ID. Actually, what's your ID? My give me your ID right now. I'm on private property. Yeah, let me give you my this ID. This is absolutely despicable. Y'all are game banging on me. <laughs> Who got us here? Who did the drive? I did. You're on my back. Right I now. did. What, really? Yeah, I did. What car do you have? That's my car. Oh, really? Really? Yeah. I let you borrow it. How about you go film the sign again? Get your no, shitty shot I, over I there. All right. I will. I'm actually filming for our video, and you're filming for what? The spot diner review. Yeah. Do you hear this, man? Yeah, we do all. Do you hear this, man? Because somebody's finally speaking the truth oh, around Jesus this place. Jesus Christ! Take where those. Students kill their friends. Oh, Blair Witch. IRL. No, it was that one where I was at your house last time. You're like, what's this case? This is the part that gets me. And wearing a smile for so long, it's real. So long, it's real. So long, it's real. It's real. Retweet and comment if you relate. Very few will. Also, like and subscribe if you relate. Do that too. Also, um, share if you relate. Only real dream stands can like and subscribe, by the way. <laughs> True. <laughs> oh, that is it. What? Okay, this is not it. That's it. Right there. Oh. <laughs> I was looking at How the, the wrong building. That? There's the Shanley. Where should we park? Right there, left. Oh, right here? Wait, no. Fuck, it's so, shoot. Oh my God. This little kid, what the hell? Hey, wait, whose baby is that crying? What the fuck? All right, all right, before we go in. Sometimes in life, there's only one way to go, and that's down the rabbit hole. That was the stupidest shit I ever <laughs> heard. Hello? Hello. So we have to sign a waiver before we go in. Um, that's very reassuring. <laughs> you can actually, here's the front page. Okay. So if you want to take pictures of you guys signing or whatever, and it's just a waiver letting you know it's paranormal in case you get touched, scratched, okay. bring anything home, we're not responsible. It's all in my goodness. <laughs> yeah, watch your head right here. Yes. trying to be touched tonight. Anna was a lady of the evening. Oh, okay. And a lot of people leave her money and stuff like that. We do not take any of the spirits money that people leave. Mm -hmm. We actually take it out of the rooms and leave it in an envelope. And when she asks us for things, okay. we buy it. She wanted a dress. She wanted a hat. So we, that's what we do with their money. Wow. Yeah. Wow, this is very interesting. Oh my goodness. Oh my so goodness. what do you think? Yeah, so... Alright, so what's taking place here is the introductory tour of a section of the hotel called the Bordello. Back during its heyday, the Shanley underwent numerous changes in not only ownership, but purpose. And with this, the resulting building that stands today seems incredibly segmented. On one side, we have the main hall. In the center, the kitchen. And off on the east end and tacked on like a bonus building is the bordello. This area, haunted by a bouncer named Frank, a little girl Rosie, and two women of the night, Anna and Maddie, is reportedly one of the most active locations in the entire hotel. Conveniently, this is where I'll be staying, with Nick braving it out, all the way in a specially chosen room just for him. Main Hall, 
Room 5. Okay, I just saw something out of the corner. Right? I'm so sorry. Fuck. The heat was down a little bit until we knew where you guys were What do you say? I don't know. I don't know. I'm so sorry. I'm literally, I know, I'm okay. So, we're in the hallway, and I turn to go into that room, and out of the corner of my eye, more than the corner of my eye, because I'm like literally turning, it was like this white, like, wisp, almost like smoke. It's like super quick, just like that. And as soon as I saw it, like, okay, first of all, goosebumps everywhere. Like, I still have them. Like, literally, my beard hairs are fucking sticking up right now. I immediately, <laughs> this was really weird, like, I immediately started to, like, I, I wanted to cry. Like, immediately. about the spirits in here as we're asking questions. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's a good idea. Okay, Do we know what that is? Th that's not like a tornado siren. Why is there a tornado siren? <laughs> okay, why is there a tornado Wait, siren going off right on. now? <laughs> turn, turn the regular light on, because something's happening. Yeah. Let's go outside and let's go to something's happening. Touch your head. Yeah, touch your head. Yeah. Is that a bomb thing? Am I, like, am I in an episode of Silent Hill right now? We were just about to start recording our actual investigation in there, and I, I don't know what is happening. I checked the weather, and there's nothing. There's nothing. No tornadoes or anything. Where the hell is everyone? Bingo? <laughs> Dude, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm still here. Oh, there's a car. There's a car coming. Oh, God. What yeah, if it's like robbers or something? That's probably why the science went off. The robbers. <laughs> the robbers. <laughs> the birds. Dude, everything's scaring me now. <laughs> okay, now I'm in a freaked out mood. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know. I'm just going to go back in Bro, this, we just sat down in the safe haunted room. Oh my god. Okay, I need a Diet Coke. <laughs> oh my god. Do we? Yeah, oh, yeah, I just need another coffee, man. Should we? <laughs> oh my god. I'm stressed drinking now. See, when you're stressed out, doing a ghost hunt, and you hear a tornado siren outside, sometimes the only thing you can do is go down the rabbit hole. Are they dropping bombs on the Shanley Hotel? <laughs> no, like, is it like a... <laughs> oh, it's bitter. God, I it? don't know. It could be like, okay, tornado, yeah, um, no. bomb, yeah. You, robbers was his theory. I don't know what the <laughs> fuck that means, but um, I'm just gonna drink my coffee and pretend like none of that happened. <laughs> So help me God, if another tornado or bomb or gang of robbers yeah. strikes, I think we just call it a day. Did you plan this? Yeah, I actually turned the siren on. <laughs> yeah. and I activated it via Bluetooth. Yeah. It's just a big ass Bluetooth speaker out there. Oh God. 
Hello, my name is Ryan. Um, <laughs> what are you laughing? <laughs> Stop laughing! I'm trying to be serious. <laughs> I'm trying to be serious. <laughs> I like the idea of us introducing ourselves because we want to be respectful. Like, I don't want to get, I, I don't want any bad vibes. You know? Yeah. I want to take this serious. I want to, I want to just be polite. Yeah. Treat them like people. You know? Yeah. Even though Absolutely. they're dead. Sorry, is that provoking? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so I'll start. My name is Ryan. Nice to meet you. Rosie, Anna, Maddie, whoever else is here. Frank, please don't kill me. We're just here to ask questions. Um, if you are here, I would love to uh, see a sign. This is our first time trying to communicate with the uh, the afterlife, and we'd love to you know, see any sign that you are here in any way, shape, or form. I guess the first question, are you here? <laughs> are you here? <laughs> What a segue. That's a good segue, right? <laughs> yeah. I'm going to set this down so you, so you know I'm not fucking with it. All right? Okay. So, yeah. All right. Frank, are you in this room tonight? Maddie, are you in this room tonight? She did say that they don't like the white light, so I could try to turn it oh, on. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah let's, let's, let's try, try it with just the red light. Are you mad that we're here asking questions? Rosie, are you here? Frank, can you give us a sign? Can anyone here give us any sign? Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Okay, so there's our sign. Okay, so someone is here with us. Someone's here. Can you tell okay. us? Yeah. Can you tell us what your name is? Well, what? how how would they tell us? EVP. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Oh. Okay. Interesting. You can get closer to that. You can get closer. It's okay. My friends with me are skeptics. They want to believe, they want to be given a sign that you guys really exist. Can you please give them that sign? Can you please give me a sign? Because I'm already getting a sign Yeah. with this. Okay. Okay, well, okay. okay um, Thank you for giving us a sign. That yeah, is exactly what we asked for. We are okay. new to this. This is frightening for us a little bit, but we want to understand you better. Okay, we're noticing some activity here. Yeah. We're really appreciative of it. So, yeah, so that, we've been up here quite a bit, and that sound has never, the sound hasn't happened, and no one else is awake. That was, this place. that was powerful too. We've heard the most yeah. powerful spirit up here is Frank. He has yeah. the ability to physically manipulate things. So Frank, if this is you, can you give us a sign? Frank, is that he just, you? He just did. Frank, I know you have been up to antics, I guess you could say, and you have choked the owner. Can you tell, can you give us a sign if that's you? Can you tell us why? Are you angry? Or is it just playful fun? Are you joking? Okay, what is, what's going on here? Oh God. Okay. Um, here, wait, let's get... Can we point the flashlight over here to see? That sounds like stairs creaking. Yeah. Can you point it down there and just see? There's literally... It's us. So, we're finally alone here and I no longer feel as comfortable anymore. <laughs> as you can see, we're terrified. But I actually have a little something special for you guys. I have a gift. 
in honor. <laughs> I spent a lot of money on this. I spent a lot of our company money on this, so you better like it, all right? So listen, we are a team, the three of us. The cool one, the lame one, and apparently the chosen one, I don't know. So in honor of our first ghost hunt, I got you Oh no. Wait, Gross. okay, I forgot who was the suit. Give me one second. First things first, I'm gonna do Justin's. There was limited bag options, but <laughs> okay. I can make it discreet so you wouldn't notice. It's your first time seeing this bag. Should I open it now or should I wait? I want you to open it now. <laughs> okay, 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 here. This is epic, guys. It's going to be, I hope you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's right behind me, isn't it? <laughs> oh, dude, thank you. Oh, dude, this is oh so god. wholesome. Oh my god. Oh, god. He's right behind me. <laughs> Second up. Take this off, man. What the fuck? I know. I know. Wait, why did I wrap my own gift? I, don't... I know. Okay, well, this one is for me. I, I did reverse what psychology on you, dude. I didn't know you. So Are you gaslighting? That's for me. Yeah. I bought that today. Well, after you. My sweet baby. Thank <laughs> you. Hello, sweet baby. Okay, can I preface this by saying, I know we have a clothing line together. Liminal wait. Land. Oh, wait. Dude, wait. what is this nice ass clothing brand we're wearing? My friend. This better be Liminal Land merch. It is not, which seems counterproductive to our brand, but. I have this effect on people. It's just. No, man. And I guess, I bet you can guess what I have in my bag. You are so sorry. Why are you apologizing? <laughs> it's okay, but it's supposed to make you happy, you know? Not wallow. I don't. <laughs> My turn. What did, yeah. you get, what did you get for yourself? In honor of my ghost hunting buddy. Uh... Wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, put that shit on, bro. <laughs> Wait, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Why the what fuck would they sell this as a pack? Wait, no, I know why, I know why, I know why. I stand here, you stand in the middle, and Justin stands on the end. Yes, Bro. that was my plan all along. That was actually the plan. Whoever sold this on Amazon <laughs> as a set of two. Yeah. Wait, no, if you flip it. Wait. Yeah, if we like, if we like. <laughs> okay, my, my gifts were flops, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Dang, so we went from matching shirts at liminalland.net, www.liminalland.net, get you a nice uh, lose yourself t-shirt. These shirts are from www.liminalland.net. Do not go there. Actually, let's never bring this up ever. Please, please go there. Do not ever go there. We're in the red, ever. please. So, oh, notice how these are not as good quality. Oh, dude, these aren't as good you know quality as, as our liminalland.net shirts. You know how much I spent on this? 45 bucks a pop. $45 for these? Oh, dude, no, Liminal Land shirts? Cheaper than that. And they're better quality. And they're better quality. www.liminalland.net. Lose yourself. Okay, all right, let's all right, get okay. Yeah, let's actually focus all right, guys. on this. What are your thoughts? Um, I'm freaked out, bro. Are you really? <laughs> like, well, like, the sirens. The sirens really creeped me out. The sirens were the weirdest thing yeah. that's happened to me all day. Like... I... I wasn't gonna mention this. This is weird. I might be reaching with this. So... <laughs> we had to open a pack of SD cards, and if you ever open one of those, you know you need scissors for it, or like a knife, or something sharp, and we didn't have anything. So I was literally scouring all over this place, looking for scissors. We found them. But before I did, I went in here. So I'm digging around in here, right? And I just see literally just a photo. 
I may be reaching like crazy. Look at this photo. Look at that middle window. Do you not see a fucking face right there? Right there. I do. This is fucking terrifying. So, like I said, I don't know if we're supposed to be digging around in here. It was just out of necessity. But this is fucking terrifying. Also, Shanley Hotel, if you're watching this, I'm very sorry. <laughs> like I said, I was just looking for scissors. Sorry. Okay, so sorry, this is such shitty footage. All right, there's something I've been curious about and it's a part that stuck with me and it is this room right here, the supposed portal. Now our guide said she went in there and somehow it was so disorienting that she got lost in this small closet for five minutes. I don't know how that's possible, but while I'm alone, I feel like I have to try it. Test, 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 test. Test, test. Yeah. I just feel like something's behind that. The air feels so different in here. Jesus, man. Okay. If there's anyone in here, can you give me a sign? Watch me be like levitating. <laughs> I guess that. I wouldn't be surprised. Nicholas? Oh my god. Where did, he, where did he go? <laughs> Everyone is a skeptic till they're sitting where I'm sitting. This is the most fucking horrifying thing I've ever done in my life. All the rational thinking out the window right now. This is terrifying. Dude, what is going on? I, I heard him, I heard him, I heard him. I was sitting in the portal. Oh, oh my God. What is this? fucking creepy. So <laughs> I wanted to sit in the portal and we're all, Honestly, everybody's a skeptic because they're sitting there alone. That was horrifying. Okay. I feel like this is kind of like the big one here. Like, this is probably gonna be the creepiest one. Like, mm -hmm. this dude's an actual killer. So, I feel like we should go in there and do a little, like, good cop, bad cop. Good cop, bad cop? So, you'd be like, okay, I'm gonna be really nice to him. Okay. And you'd be like, you know, be a bad cop, you know? Yeah. Okay. Like, okay. Don't be afraid of him. That's fair. Okay, okay yeah. So, yeah. We'll, yeah. All right. I wanna put this in Joe's room. We're just out here, at least. Yeah, so if anything walks by... Y'all? Dude. Dude. Oh my god, dude, that was the worst timing. That was the worst timing. What is that? What is going on? Seriously. It's been two hours. What the fuck? Did you hear that? What was that? Did Wait, you, what the fuck? Did you hear that? What was that? The door? Sound like a door slam? Did you hear that? Wait, are yeah. you serious? Yeah, that had to have been a door, right? Wait, dude, tell me you're joking. Please tell me you're joking. Okay, hold on. Because sure. this thing is going off and it won't stop. It's not normal. Okay, you got sirens going off. I swear to fuck, I just heard a door slam. I heard it too. I swear no, to God. No, I heard it too. Like, the, the camera okay, definitely captured like that. I do not like this right now at all. Like, this is seriously making me feel uneasy. Okay. You know what happened last time we heard these sirens? Shit started popping off in the bordello. Like, we heard a ton of shit. Yeah, dude. Do y'all get tornado sirens up here a lot? No. Never. Never. What the Never fuck? Exist here. Okay, we need to see if any doors are closed. I don't even know how the fuck we know.
Still burning. What does that smell? <laughs> you smell burning? This place is like a ghost town, man. There's, there's no one coming out to check on this at all. I would have at least come outside. What is that? I heard a car. Oh my god, what's going on? I don't know. This is a small, there's nothing around here. I have never once in my life seen tornado sirens go off, followed by ambulance sirens. It just can't be tornado sirens. They just don't happen here. That's so weird. Okay, dude. whatever it is, it's freaky. Let's get back in the safety of the chimney. Yeah, let's go talk to a serial killer now. Now it's not going off. You should set it up right outside our room in the hallway so if anything walks by. I'm telling you, this is okay, the spot. What? Okay, all right, well, let's take a second here and just look at this. Because it's not going off. Right fucking here. Right in front of Adam's room, it goes off. Literally does not go off whatever I do here. Guys, what? this sounds like a meme, but it's 10 minutes from 3 a.m. <laughs> I love how we're like halfway through our investigation. <laughs> we thought we'd be setting our alarms to wake up at 3 a.m. Little did we know we're like a quarter way through. What the fuck? Okay, this is weird. Dude. Okay, <laughs> let's set up in here. Holy okay, shit. should I just put it right here on the floor? Yes, put it. Like, just outside of the... Dude, there's like an invisible wall here or something. What the fuck? Alright? Yep. Alright, nothing. What the fuck? Yep. <laughs> there's just no way. Like... Wait, wait, what happens if what? you just stand what? here? Right past the door now. What if you just stand here? It just keeps going up. Okay, I'm gonna put this right here then. What type of spooky bullshit is this? Oh my God. Okay, yeah, that's just gonna stay there. It's this room. Okay. It is this, no, this fucking room. room. Okay. All right, Adam. We've heard quite a bit about you and some things that you may have done in a past life. First of all, is your name really Adam? I don't think your name's Adam. Was that you? Was no. that you? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> some things that you may have done in a past life. First of all, is your name really Adam? I don't think your name's Adam. Is that you? Is your name really Adam? I don't think your name's Adam. Is that you? Adam, are you in this room right now? If there is a spirit in this room right now, can you give us a knock on something? If there's a spirit in here right now, can you give us any sign at all? If a spirit can hear me, can you do this? Can you knock on the walls? If you're here, can you give us any sign at all? Adam or Sarah. So Sarah was the one who hung herself, right? If that's the case, I think she did it in that room. So maybe we should go check that out. Yeah, so far we haven't really got anything on this yet. So yeah, this has been kind of dead in the water so far. Sarah, are you in here? 
Do you feel like the temperature here? Yeah, wait, it's cold. It's real cold right here. I don't know if that's just me. No, it is. Like, that's definitely a dip. Okay. Yeah, this is Sarah's. No, this is Claire's room. Like, who is Sarah? No, 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 this is this is the room that the girl hung herself this in. This is Claire who hung herself. Oh, Claire she's pregnant, hung herself. and her boyfriend didn't want anything to do with her. Claire likes flowers. Wait, did you hear? Was that you knocking? What was that? You heard that, right? The knocking. I just heard a knock. I heard a. Y'all heard a knock? What the yeah. yeah. I didn't hear it. I didn't hear shit. Just like I fucking did on the wall. Just Wait. like I did on the wall. No, yeah. No, what? It was literally... Clear her and her boyfriend didn't want anything to do with her. Claire likes flowers. Wait. Did you hear... Was that you knocking? What was that? You heard that, right? The knocking? I just heard a knock. Claire likes flowers. Did you hear? Was that you knocking? <laughs> it's literally 3 a.m., guys. Oh my what the God. fuck? Wait, this is not a meme. This is like. This is not a meme. Wait, 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 wait. Do you guys wanna like? Okay. Uh, I mean, it sounded like this room. I don't know. I feel like we should go in this room two. one more time. Good luck. What? What the fuck just happened? Dude. That's, that, had be, that had to be her, right? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Dude. Dude. Oh, no. That, that is... That's I don't like that Something was touching that. Okay, okay. Heard the knock. Coming like from that. over there. That fucking crashing noise was not her. Her door is closed. Can we go? All right. Um, I think it's time I... for good cop, bad cop again. Can I just go check real quick, just to ease I... my mind? I... Hopefully, I see her down there. You, you, Here, take, take, take this. Um, yeah. <laughs> fucking grab that. Do you understand? Okay, that wasn't just a trip, trip, trip. That was a full-on fucking grab. The purple light went off. Okay, we well can cut back to footage of the purple light going off. It only happens when Ryan himself or I am grabbing it. Like that is hands-on. We're gonna go see if it was a ghost or a human. And the knock and, was coming from me. Knock. And the crashing noise. Justin, what the fuck? I'm sorry. Dude, this, yeah, like, if she's not up, that's unexplainable. Oh, fuck, that's us. Wait, was it coming? Okay, look at this. Look at this. See how close we're not going up. That's grabbing. Fingers touching. Guys, I have, I have zero sign of any activity down here at all. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck. Bro, I don't know what to say. Get wait, 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 wait. It's going off again. Come back up here. Come back up here. Look at this. What the fuck? What the fuck? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. What the fuck? Get the fuck up here. Wait, what the act? What the? Holy 
shit. No fuck. Dude, nobody's down here at all. I'm in the bordello. I'm almost in the bordello. No one's up, no one's over here. Who's here with us? Wait. Who is here with us? I barely Ooh, okay, wait, okay. I barely got the MF, wait. but holy shit. Who is there someone with us right now? Who is here? We know there's a spirit. Who are you? Not like this at all. I don't like this at all. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Check this room. NBD. Everything is good. Hey, what's up you guys? It's your boy, Nexpo, coming at you live with a ghost exploration video. Tonight, we are going to be exploring the Haunt Shanley. And yeah, it's definitely really spooky, guys. So let's keep exploring, because I'm trying to keep myself sane and talk to myself, because I'm literally the only one on this side of the town. Oh, Let's keep exploring, cause I'm trying to keep myself sane and talk to myself because I'm literally the only one on this side of the hotel alone. Let's keep exploring, cause I'm trying to keep myself sane and talk to myself because I'm literally the only one on this side of the hotel alone. I have never seen anything like that in my one day of ghost hunting here. That this this is some phasmophobia shit. This was fucking glitching out red. Well, it was glitching. Uh, what okay. was going on? Okay, I don't know. If, I don't know if I even fucking got the EMF. Reason, okay, but I saw, I saw at the very end. This like, this was literally going all the way red, like fucking crazy, glitching out like I've never seen before. Okay, so here's the deal. So we were all in the attic on the third floor, right? Right when activity started like acting up, we started hearing a bunch of shit downstairs. Like someone was awake, closing doors and opening doors and all that, right? Okay, my mind automatically went to like, oh, it's the owner or the tour guide that was like showing us around, right? So you and I come down here and we check and there's no one here. No one's awake. And now I have no idea who or what that was. And I'm a little spooked out right now, and I'm chilling in complete darkness with the red light in front of me, talking to a camera. So I'm scared. Fuck, fuck, dude. Okay. What? Dude? Okay. <laughs> I, we, I, I want to leave. <laughs> I want to leave. Wait, okay. T tell, test, test. Tell Ryan. Uh, we're all clear over here, Roger. Um, I am going to come back because I am a little bit scared. Okay, let's go meet him. Bro, everything went fucking crazy up here. The EMF went insane. The fucking red box was going off like someone was touching it. Bro, I'm terrified. Wait, are you serious right now? I swear to fucking God, we have it all on camera. Where are you? I'm in the Bordello side, but are you guys walking around? Because I can hear footsteps, but I, no one's above me. We were up, we still? We're upstairs. But we're not on your side of the building. Oh God. Can you hear this? Yes. Okay, that's just us, I think. All in the lobby. Yeah, yeah we're coming towards you. Oh thank God. Guys, I was so scared. Dude, that was, was fucking so nuts. Scared, dude. What happened? The what happened? Fucking <laughs> thing. Okay, first of all, can we take it from the top? Yeah. The knocking. That started everything. And then bro. She's not awake. No. Stop. Yeah, okay, all right. You, okay. My mind is trying to rationalize this, okay? Okay. So I came down. Mm -hmm. you now we were kind of like looking around, me and, me and the audience. <laughs> we're kind of looking around. <laughs> um, I didn't hear or see anything. Did you yeah. turn this light on, by the way? I did, yeah. Okay. Actually, do you want to shut the red lights off while we talk yeah. about this? Nothing, nothing has moved. No one's awake over there. She's yeah. not over there. She's not over here. Um, so she's in a room that was crashing it was Wait. like but i did hear something it was over here and it's a place we haven't really explored i would like to explore with you guys okay so right no 
I was coming down the stairs. I took two steps. Okay. I swear I heard something over here. I looked over here thinking something was over here. Okay, this is where I saw that thing. Really? This is where you're sleeping. Because this, this is room five. Okay, in, right in this corner. And it was moving into this room over here. What I saw breezed right past, and I think it went into here or there. Oh, dude. Master, oh shit. She you died here too, right? In she's sickness? Part. Influenza. Influenza. In, in 1918. She, yes. And she's part of the reason why Beatrice is so, like, I guess, sad all the time. Yeah. She's, like, wandering out around looking for everyone, anyone, because she lost everyone in her life. That's probably like, who you saw then. Beatrice, or not Beatrice, Esther coming back to her room. And you were staying right across from here. Oh my god, okay. Well, okay, so what happened? Okay. Fill me in. <sighs> Fuck, that was so scary. We hear crashing. So first the knock, we're yeah. crashing. You go downstairs, and then that fucking EMF red box yeah. started going crazy. Like, and I mean like psychotic. Like someone was fucking manhandling it. And then this started peeking red. Wait. Red box, yeah, started going crazy. Like, and I mean, like, psychotic. Like, someone was fucking manhandling it. And then this started peeking red. Wait. Like, and I mean, like, psychotic. Like, someone was fucking manhandling it. And then this started peeking red. You guys ever played Outlast? Oh yeah. Oh yo. I'm doing real that. life Outlast. That's my only source of light. So oh, Jesus. This is gonna be bad. Oh, I already don't like it. I already really don't like it. Okay. So I'm gonna talk to myself. <laughs> I've never done anything this creepy. So the story about the little girl who passed away in the well, that well is still here, kind of. It's like buried with cement now and stuff, but I wanna go over there, at least try and get some sort of like, Communication with Rosie. I don't know if her spirit's gonna be there, but let's just try. Is this it? So this is what remains of the well. I think this is all just like covering it. It might even be completely filled in, but I figured we'd at least try and get some sort of EVP here. Rosie, if you're out here, can you give us a sign that you're still here? just rip ass. Yeah. <laughs> That's so disrespectful. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> no, this is a serious moment. Rosie, I'm so sorry. I'm literally... <laughs> it's natural, dude. It's natural, but... We've been digging around for 20 minutes. You waited for this moment here. <laughs> I can't control... You know, just you, I you to stay away from the well for a minute. He's, he's, he's stopping the monologue. Stopping a monologue. Well, I'm supposed to just keep rolling with it. You know, you know, you know, do you know the sound that those microphones pick up? That probably sounded like a sonic boom. I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to not stop my monologue. Really? Okay. We're talking to a dead girl. She's like three years old. Let's have a little class, some dignity. We're, we're ghost hunters now. Look at it. Ghost hunting buddies. Notice wonder, it's, not, it's not pointing to you. <laughs> for a reason. Yeah. It's not pointing to <laughs> you. You left your ghost hunting partner right up there. Look at that. It's pitch black in here. And you guys are really gonna love this, but right at my feet,
that's a, that's a Ouija board. Really bad. Rosie, I'm so sorry for what happened to you. It is a tragedy. <laughs> your story is heartbreaking. Um, I want to know if your soul is here or if you've finally gotten to rest. Adam. Give me a sign. Where are you? find some stuff that was, that was a fun little segment did you capture anything um so that was going off a couple times that okay. was it okay I was trying to find adam but shit adam wasn't coming out all right well we didn't really capture anything either except for justin <laughs> ripping ass during oh in the God. middle of a fucking evp session <laughs> <He's serious. laughs> it's, it's unfortunately i'm serious <laughs> y'all do you guys want to do go to the bordello or something? Go yeah, to we can go to the bordello. Let's go. Rosie's room. Okay. All right. So just so you guys know. On this alternative view here, that is my room I'm sleeping in. So, have fun with that. Yeah, I'm not going to. <laughs> I know you're not. <laughs> um, okay. So, Anna, is that you in there? Anna, is that you? Rosie, is that you playing with the light? Are you trying to be funny? Maddie, is that you playing with the light? Anna, turn the light off. That's you. Oh my god. Anna, is that you? Anna, am I allowed to sleep in there tonight? Turn the light on if I'm allowed to sleep in there tonight. Anna, turn the light on if you do not like me. Oh my god. That's fucking crazy. What the fuck? I mean, shit, I don't blame her. Dude, fuck you. I'm about to sleep in there, man. <laughs> okay. okay, okay. You okay, saw okay. my room. You saw my room. Yeah. Too. I, think it's all, I think we're all fair here. Okay. Anna, turn the light off if you don't like me. The timing of that is just too crazy. All right, what if I go in there with that? You ask questions and I'll tell you what I hear.
Mm -mm. Yeah, I'm still... Listen. Anna, what do I listen to? Close. Who's close? Is it Frank? He An was all I had. Is it Frank, Anna, or Maddie? Or Rosie? Sure. Who's here right now? Is, is someone here right now? A child. A child. Rosie. Rosie, is that you? Rosie, are you here? A baby. Rosie. Rosie, if that's you, give me a sign. It's okay. It's okay, Rosie, you know if you're me. here. Avoid me. Avoid me. Rosie, do I avoid you? Cold water. Oh my god, that is Rosie. Dude. Rosie, what about cold water? The dress? Revenge. I don't know if that's Rosie, man. Burning. Location. Okay, so this place burned down. Okay, so we Say got cold water. Home. 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 Burning. Okay, so this place burned down 50 years after it opened. Who was... Who is here right now? Who are you? The TV. Three. Give me a sign. Give me more of a sign. Grab it. Friends only. Is this Rosie? Is this Frank? Jeez. Good seeing you. In the attic. I got a weird sensation in there. I feel like something touched my arm. This has been going off. You said cold water burning home. Yeah. Right after we were talking about Rosie. Fuck. Did you yeah. hear and what I said at the end? No. Good seeing you in the attic. Oh. The oh, attic. what? I heard that. I didn't hear the attic part. It, it was good Good seeing you in the attic. And then, look at, look at my arm. I just felt like, you see you my goosebumps? Serious? Look at probably hard to see but oh whoa I literally like felt a grab like it, it wasn't like a grab grab but it was like something yeah. like like right, something I said the name Frank this started lighting up again so obviously like something's going on here with, with Frank I think you should try one swap just for a little bit like okay. because that was because the attic is where everything happened yes yeah, that's, that's very strange that I, I did not hear the attic part so. Good okay. seeing you in the attic, right one after another. Oh my god. Fuck. Dude, that was no joke. In the light, the flashlight was going on and off, like in correlation to like the shit she was saying. Who 
whoever you are, can you at least tell us your name? Is that... Can you give us any indication that you understand what I'm saying? Nothing hurts me. Still want to do it. Is this Adam? Ho ass. <laughs> Is this Adam? Did you follow us from the attic to here? Everything is fine. I just got like a spike sensation on my arm. Oh my god. Adam, this is you, isn't it? Finish him. Finish you. I feel it. It sounds like you're describing a murder. Is this one of the murders that you partook in, Adam? Weekend. Cold as death. Cold as death. <laughs> Adam, how many people did you kill? Tall skin. Adam, can you tell me about one of your murders? Go home with you. Please don't come home with us. It's more. Your home is here. If, if that's what you're insinuating, please don't come home with us. Your home is here. Do you want to leave here? You'll die. Okay, I don't want to die. None of us want to die. Pass them. Adam, what are you talking about? <laughs> Fuck, this is actually funny. Adam. Oh my god. Do you really want to come home with us? Go. Flee. We didn't mean to offend you. You sound angry with us. Are you mad? Fun. You're having fun? Why do you seem angry? Do you want to hurt us? Like you hurt all those victims? Three. Wait, like three of us? Three of us? Come on in. Come on in. Three of us. What do you want to do to us? Listen, there's dying to come. What the fuck? Adam, I... Adam, wh what have Quiet. we done to offend you? In a series. All eyes are in. Alright, Adam, it sounds like you're no longer here. Is there anyone else who wants to communicate? Let him cook. You fell off. Dear God. <sighs> well, a lot of. A lot of. A lot of powers. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Such a reach. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I just got chills. Really? Yeah. I want to take a picture of you right now. I don't know okay, I have no idea if any of that correlated with literally anything, but we'll see. <laughs> anything? Yes. Actually, a lot. Any of that makes sense? So, yes, a lot of it did. Uh -huh. Dude, we thought... We okay. <laughs> so, I was asking about, like, like, what did you mean by, it was good seeing you in the attic, or whatever they said. And, dude, I'm pretty sure it was, um, Adam, who was, like, trying to communicate. Assuming that, that, that to be real, like, he was talking about, like, killing us and shit like that, and coming home with us. I swear to God, it was weird, like. Okay, I don't like that at all. Like, that, like. I got chills right now. I know, because as soon as he started to saying, like, coming home with us, and then some shit about us dying. I thought it was talk talking about, like, Anna coming home with us, like. Lady of the night kind of thing. So, I don't think so. 
because we were talking then I asked him how many victims you had and because this is after he was like threatening us low key and then he said three one Stop. two three. Oh no I know but they could be fucking with us I don't know that is not where I thought this would go <laughs> it was not it, it, it did not feel wholesome I don't know what do you think should we say like the Lord's Prayer or something Okay, so I'm exhausted, like, to the point where I can barely keep my eyes open, mm -hmm. but I don't want to go to bed. Same. Fuck. <laughs> now I see why people leave in the middle of the night. I get it. Personally, I'm fine sleeping. <laughs> you guys want to sleep? You're scared. I am a little scared. scared. After you said that, yeah, I'm absolutely yeah. a little scared. Me too. <laughs> All right. Let's try and sleep on our own. Okay. Let's do it. But just just remember when you're about to fall asleep, yeah. think to yourself, Dude, it's Sir right behind me, it. isn't it? <laughs> you got the skip, bro. I'm up, I'm about to walk half a mile to my room, okay? Wait a second. It's it's not even. That, we're in a different building technically. It's right behind you, isn't it? <laughs> I hate this channel, and this sucks. This really sucks. horrified right now. I don't even want to go in this room. <sighs> of all the rooms here, the one that gives me the worst vibe is of course the one that I have to sleep in. I'm gonna set up my GoPro for tonight and just hope, hope that nothing creepy happens. I've seen enough. I'm as convinced as I can be. I just let me sleep now. All right guys, so here's the deal. I genuinely wanna know if ghosts are real and I'm willing to put my money where my mouth is and I am gonna sleep in this room, Anna's room, the room where we heard the message from Adam alone. So, yeah, <laughs> and you guys are going to accompany me the whole night, or most of the night, because these tapes are only two hours long, and I don't have an extra camera, so um, we're going to make it work. We're going to make it work. I'm in my pajamas. I'm going to chill. I'm going to go to bed. Um, so if you see anything or hear anything that I don't in the moment right now, um, yeah, let me know. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I'm gonna turn on night vision, so give me a second. Okay, I'm gonna try and sleep now, but I'm scared. It's damn near five o'clock. I've had enough, I've seen enough. I'm gonna set this camera up and just see if it captures anything when I sleep. If I do sleep. Oh, fuck. Oh boy, I'm in here with Anna. Hello, Anna. I think what I'm gonna do is just kind of scope it out, you know, see if we hear anything tonight, uh, if we see anything tonight. It's definitely been an eventful night, but this is something that is like honestly really new to me because I have never like tried to seek out ghosts or anything before, so, 
Yeah. You guys ever watch like Meat Canyon? He's got some pretty good stuff. Meat Canyon, he makes cartoons, but they're like really, it's, it's really well done. Like there was one that really stood out to me. It's called Blue Clue. Dude, that, that shit, that shit stabbed me right in the heart. I was like, man, I, I feel that. Because I've been dealing with that shit. I've been dealing with that shit. I kind of don't want to stop talking because <laughs> I don't want, I don't want it to be quiet in here. I'm scared. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to go to sleep now. I might see something, but I don't, I don't know. I'm not gonna see anything because I'm gonna be dreaming. But I might hear something. That's what I meant. Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to go to sleep. Now. So, I left the music box on in Maddie's room, and I just heard it go off. Oh my god, I don't want to move. I was like almost asleep too, I don't want to move. This thing. I keep hearing like this. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Because I'm genuinely like freaked out right now. I'm not even using a camera, I'm using my phone.
Okay, because I don't have an extra camera. I do have... What's this? Okay, so we're going to use this. This is a portable microphone. I'm going to place this right next to the music box. I'm going to go back to sleep. Because I want... I want you guys to hear this, even if the other camera doesn't pick it up. Okay, I'm just gonna leave this right here. Okay. Okay, that was that was that was a ride. God. I have, a sh I have, a, I have, I'm, my whole body is a big show right now. Oh my god. That was the longest it was going off, too. That was like five seconds straight. I feel like whatever, whoever that is, is messing with me right now at this point. Like, they know. They know that I know. And now I feel like my ears are playing tricks on me. Like, am I hearing this or am I not? I'm never gonna forget this. I'm, I'm legitimately never gonna forget this. Are you there? Anna, is that you? Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Oh my god. Hearing this in the distance is is Fucking terrifying, okay? I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, this is actually really creepy to me. Anna, I know I'm in your room. Oh my god, I, I was I was planning on just going to going to bed. Okay, this is a plot twist. Rosie, is that you? There's the microphone. Are you here? It's okay, you can give me a sign if you're here. Are you playing with the music box? You can give me a sign. back into the room and that's gonna go off again I already know it. how much you want to bet that's gonna go off again I'm gonna go back in the room that music box was going off over and over and over like every five minutes 
and then I went out there and it stopped. But I think you guys heard like a piece of it. Like, right when I opened the door, you guys heard a piece of it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Okay, it's, it's something's messing with me. Something is messing with me here. Oh my god, okay. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. I get goosebumps. Um. Okay, so whatever... What, <laughs> so whatever is up here with me is... Just one. Right when the door slammed, it stopped. Yeah, Maddie's room's haunted. I'm not going in there anymore. Well, Maddie, Maddie's room's haunted. I don't want to go in there. It's six in the morning. And I can't sleep. Hey, Justin. I've got to show Nick this. Like, I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. <laughs> Nick. At all. At all. And all of it's on this camera. That fucking music oh, box man. is going ham. Like it's it's right going now. ham tonight. Yes. I oh, shit, I just fell asleep. <laughs> are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Like holy shit. Dude, what I I am legit like oh my god. kinda scared. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. I just want to show you that and kind of have a second eyes. Now it's on your camera too, so we got like oh my two God. copies. Oh. If this corrupts, you experienced it. Bro, if you're free, you can just pass out in the end. Yeah, in these quarters. You know, I'm probably do that. I almost did that. <laughs> yeah. Alright, man. Well, See you in almost three hours. Yeah, literally. Officially the next morning, I'm alive. Thank God. Um, Ryan woke me up at literally <laughs> like 6 a.m. right when I fell asleep. So I got even less sleep than expected, but I think it was worth it because the footage he got was crazy. <laughs> All right, I'm leaving and I'm never coming back. Goodbye, spirits of this room. You thoroughly spooked me. Okay, so currently it is 9.46 a.m. 
our checkout time is 10, but there's been no sign of Ryan. Um, I do know that he was wide awake and yelling at 6 a.m. So something tells me he didn't get a lot of sleep last night, but it is our, our duty to wake him up now. So shall we? We shall. <laughs> Did you just nod with the camera? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Never do that shit again. I'm just kidding. <laughs> also, sidebar. If we go over 10 a.m., then we get charged $150. And we do not have that in the budget right now, so. What if he's dead? That'd be epic. <laughs> That'd be epic. I do know one thing that will wake him up. Okay. I'm a little drunk and I could cry right now. You're a dick. And I'm a vibe right now. Dude, I was like haunted the whole night. Did you, did you tell Justin about that? Yeah. <laughs> did anything happen after that? No, I just, I was too tired. Yeah, I, I, I was literally dead when you walked into but my that room. Started, okay, so that started going off again what? when I came back up here. Yeah. So we told them about that and they're like oh yeah that's that that happens in the bordello that's they're really active up there with that specifically and i'm like oh, oh my god all right so spirits do not follow us home okay the car <laughs> bye shanley bye shanley you thoroughly spooked us i'm on like one hour sleep i know i'm dead <laughs> okay all right spirits stay with thee and not with me Spirits, stay with thee and not with me. Spirits, stay with thee and not with me. Stay with Justin and not with us. No, hey, Let's hey, stay no. Stay with Justin one. and not with Austin. <laughs> that worked. Yes. That, that flowed very well. <laughs> I feel like that was a fitting end to this trip. But when you, okay, when you came into my room, you were sounding like a full-on believer. Honestly, though, <laughs> like, dude, you, you, like that, it was messing with me, man. Yeah. That Don't was you, that was genuinely scary, man. Like. Honestly. Okay, so I'm not fully, fully convinced, but being in there, I'm like, all right. I think I believe a little more than I did before. I definitely believe a lot more. You sound like you before. Did. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. You know what? I feel like I'm a believer too, because. Get copier. <laughs> all right, I'm a skeptic now. Yeah, you're a skeptic. <laughs> Actually, I believe less now. I'm not gonna lie to you, I wasn't expecting our first foray into the world of the paranormal to have so much activity. From the knocks, to the bizarre sounds, to the weird whispers, the music box, and even those unexplained tornado sirens, the Shanley Hotel kept us on edge for the entire evening. Regardless if you're a believer or not, what we experienced last night will stick with us forever. And even if every single thing can be explained away with some sort of mundane reason, the journey we're setting off on is merely beginning. All across the world are places much like the Shanley, and what better way to spend our time than by bringing you along with us. So stay a while and hold on for the ride as we bring you into the dark. <laughs>